They're certainly tough right now. Many are out of work. Money is tight and food is short. That's why Three Cares is taking part in the million meals effort to make sure no one goes hungry. Channel 3 New Haven Bureau Chief Matt McFarland looks at the need from two food drives along the shoreline. Nice and slow. Don't stop. Thank you. With their trunks popped, cars slowly snake their way around the Bass Pro Shops right off 95 in Bridgeport. I could not believe it. I mean, it's around three, four different corners. There's three lanes in the street all the way around. Just like Jesse Austin, each family here is just looking for a little extra food during what's already such a difficult time for so many. It's helping beyond belief. It's helping because the prices have gone high. With a small army of volunteers, the Connecticut Food Bank says this drive through pantry is the largest single day distribution in the food bank's history. We've never done this before. 1,500 families are going to come roll through here today. We're going to give them 60,000 pounds of food. That's, we figure, Enough to make 50,000 meals. That's right, 50,000 meals in just a few hours. Everything from yogurt and soups to bread and snacks, along with fresh fruit and vegetables. There is a pretty good uh, actually option for the people who doesn't have a food and to help families. The turnout shows you just how great the need is right now, and folks say they are so thankful for this opportunity. And the Connecticut Food Bank tells us as long as those donations keep coming in, they'll keep doing drives just like this. The richest people in the state right down we're seeing seniors giving us a piece of their Social Security. It's amazing what's going on in the state, the way they're helping their neighbors out. This afternoon, a perfect example at another mobile food drive in East Haven. The Antonacci family, which owns all American waste, is donating a half million dollars to help fight food insecurity across Connecticut and Western Mass. It's really become uh, abundantly clear how, how necessary it is for all of us to step up and, and do what we can to, to fix this food insecurity problem. Today they presented a check for $125,000 to the Connecticut Food Bank, teaming with WFSB's Three Cares Initiative and iHeartRadio as part of the Millions of Meals push. Our hope is that other people that are doing okay right now can either donate time or donate some funds to make sure that we could do this as long as it's absolutely necessary to get through this crisis. And back in Bridgeport, Jesse says this means so much. I'm thankful that there's something that I can feed the kids. God bless these people for doing what they're doing. With the Mobile Newsroom, Matt McFarland, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.